Welcome to the Shore VR. We're playing the early access Steam version on a MetaQuest 2 through virtual desktop. Before we get started, take a minute to click the S in the corner to subscribe. Heading for 10,000 subscribers would be fantastic if you were one of them. Also like, share, leave a comment. Let me know what you think of the video or the game or any tips or tricks you have for the Shore or feedback for the developers. This VR port is early access, so they'll be fixing a lot of issues and taking a lot of bug reports. Let's get to it here. As I understand it, this is a desktop game that's been ported to VR, and it's based on the works of HP Lovecraft, of whom I'm a huge fan. So we're either gonna die or go insane with that in mind. Let's get to it. It seems like we're shipwrecked. Lighthouse in the distance. I'm not sure which of these is our boat. We've got a spear over our shoulder. The hand angle is a little odd. That's about the natural controller angle. We've got our journal here, which I don't think you can open, but maybe I just haven't found that yet. And uh, we have a backpack with slots to take things out of, but I haven't been able to put things into the slots that way. You put things in by holding them over your shoulder. I tried with AirLink because sometimes Virtual Desktop has some controller issues and, and Air Link's the same. Personally, I had worse performance with Air Link, but uh, different machines, that'll, that'll be different, I would think. Okay, where to go? I mean, the lighthouse is the obvious destination. Doesn't seem like we can pick anything up. Can we skirt through here? To this other boat. Another seagull. Can we get around here? We can. Ooh. And a poor soul. That's a big gull. Candles on the shore for those wandering sailors. And uh, a hanging arm. Oh, ho. that looks like it says Cthulhu Relay. So this is a uh, Cthulhu cultist. Can we get that? We can. Where did that go? in our oh there we are okay I have offered my right arm and spoke the correct words in his absence only pain accompanies me towards my demise I was forced to leave the lighthouse there's something wrong in all of us only the slumbering God can save us now the slumbering God being Cthulhu as I recall, and I'm due for a reread of The Call of Cthulhu, a short story about that god. Uh, I think it was a fisherman was the only living person to see Cthulhu rise from the water. H.P. Lovecraft is great. You can read all his short stories and pretty small book actually. I'll put a link in the description to a compilation. I highly recommend reading his complete works. We've got some big fish on the shore here. Ooh. 
sort of pike we can't pick up. I mean, we got a spear. Oh, it's a shark. But we can't pick up that uh, pole. Oh, hello, what's this? Well, that looks inviting. I mean, how can we not? What was that? I see tentacles in the water out there. This looks like a happy fellow. Can we grab this? An incandescent orb, cold to the touch. Holding it reminds you of your days at sea. Salt water. Oh, oh. Well, that's not good. Is that coming this way? Maybe we should back up. So that's just out there. Good to know. And we stole its pearl. And now there's voices all over. That's fun too. What's in here? And we've got a little Cthulhu icon and some sort of medallion. with uh, Cthulhu in the middle there. Seems to have been made by pressing smaller figures into it while fresh. You say so. Can we put that in our pack? Yeah, we have those in our pack. Not sure what we're going to be doing with any of this stuff. My hand angle kind of wigged out a bit. You don't want to admit it, but you'd swear one of the tentacles at the base of the relic moved. Just, uh... You hang out there. Let's see if we can get up to the lighthouse. It's over here. Man, this island is littered with um, wholesome art installations, right, fella? Um, can we, can I put this in there? Doesn't seem like it. We kind of expect it to snap. Yeah, that's my natural hand angles now, so it seems like this hand <laughs> flipped. Yeah, oh well. We'll just deal. Well, that looks pleasant. Some weird tendril-like things swaying in the distance. Just a whole overflowing bowl of happy this place is. going to pass this hand thing off as uh, more black magic. We have these symbols on us like like we're a cultist. If we were a sailor we'd have you know an anchor or uh, some swallows or maybe a mom tattoo well, there's something. This is like all of Lovecraft's stories combined into one island. This is what, the color out of space? Don't quite recall. The something out of something. All right, how do we get to the lighthouse then?
That doesn't look natural. But then again, a lot of sea creatures don't look natural. Get me a shark's tooth. Can we get up this way? Uh, looks like no. Just a dead end. Here we got a, a path. Black cat crossing our path. Some salmon on a skillet. We've got some sort of dungeon. And <laughs> a cage. Pleasant. And here we are. Hey fella. HP Lovecraft had a had a black cat with a with a very inappropriate name. Is this your litter box? Kinda looks uh Egyptian. Lovecraft also had an affinity for Egyptology from an exhibit he saw at a museum, I believe, in his local area, perhaps. Hmm, another medallion. Can we put this over our shoulder? Nope. Can we get that now? Yeah. Can we get it with this hand? Yeah. Doesn't want to go in the pack. Okay. I guess we're not meant to pick that up or to, to store it, I should say. Hey, there's another one. Yeah, too many of them for us to collect them unless we're collecting them like currency. Huh. Ooh, that looks like an elder god. I wonder where the inhabitant is. A chess set, some maps, nice paisley pillow. Ooh, a circular shape is home to a mass of adjoining tendrils and a singular eye. The gaze makes you uncomfortable. Yeah, there's some text, but it generally appears too low, probably for you to see in the recording. Look at that eye. Can we take that? Ooh, we can take that. Can we take the straight razor? Might want that later. Well, that's just our journal. It's this one. I have never seen such creatures before. Something is wrong here, like the god have forsaken this place and its creations. The fish-like people. Uh-oh, fish-like people. That would be the folks from Innsmouth. Not seeing anything else we can Oh, what's that? Grab that? No. There's another medallion. Okay. And another one. Big hooks. All right. Up we go. Hatchet. No, can't take the hatchet. <laughs> that looks like it might come in handy too, but. The 
armless torso seems to depict a malnourished being with a horrific face. Yeah, some sort of beetle head. And there's, there's our boy. From the moment I touched that artifact, I was stunned by the darkness within it. A million visions of a horrific figure claimed my mind. see something over there and there's that I don't know what it is but not good not good some lovecrafty and abomination yog soth of of the earth. We'll find out, I guess. Huh. Another gull. They've got to be leading us, you would think. Those uneducated fools, they won't let me write for them. They are all fishermen with dirty scuffed clothes, and they smell horrible. Their beards smell of alcohol, and they spit when they talk. I'd rather stay another four hours on this post and take care of the problematic mechanism of this handcrafted construct. I do not regret this journey. My life has become more interesting since then. Not to mention the view from up here. All the hatred, misery, and sadness of mankind fade away into the straight line where the sea and the sky collide. So, can I do anything here? Don't look natural. Our first boss fight. Do anything here? Doesn't seem like it. Can we get around this way? What's all this then? Hey, yeah. We summon that thing. I swear I saw something towards the horizon behind the mist. It wasn't a whale or a great shark. Its numerous legs stretched a hundred feet. By submerging its body into the sea, it crawled as if it was infected by a thousand parasites. should start placing those talisman I found at the bottom of the lighthouse around the pathways we made. Okay. So he thinks the talismans are gonna protect him. We have some sort of demonic chest set with the, with the bishop missing. Looks like one of those. Hey, that's the one down there but it's too big for up here. I think it's the right color to match the, the white, but it's four times the size. Crowbar, can we pick up the crowbar? It doesn't seem like it. Okay, well, maybe we'll head down and we'll see if we can grab that thing. Bring it up here. My right hand keeps Keeps wigging out. Um, it's not over here, is it? No. Okay. So, to get back to that thing, we gotta go down this way. 
I don't know if it's going to fit in our pack. There it is. Well, it looks a bit darker now that I'm down here. Oh no. That's the right color. It's in our pack now. So let's see what that does. Doesn't seem to be a sprint. All right, sprint back. I suspect sprinting is going to come in handy at some point. Up the stairs again. I only have four backpack slots, that's why I'm not just grabbing everything and shoving it in the pack, but that's going to lead to a lot of back and forth, I guess. As I realize what might come in handy. All right. Around here. Over here. What is that? Okay. Hold on, did I get that? Okay, no. Wait for it to change color. There we go. I mean, that is the, uh, the right piece. It goes this way, though. It's not doing anything, so I guess this is not what it's for. I mean, it is, the size is kind of mismatched. Let me grab it with this hand instead. And I can't even put it down now, so I think it just has to go back in the pack. Well, swing and a miss. I still feel good about that, uh, that attempt. So, what did we see over there? Some sort of lit up cavern, it looks like. Well, let's do some exploring. Looks like the lighthouse is uh, tapped out. Okay, which way? We got a couple picket pathways. Huh. Oh. Looks like something's in there. Take a look at this. Maybe we'll come back here in a second. See what else there is. I don't want to enter that circle just yet. Because I have a feeling if there's combat, I'm going to perish due to mechanics. Or sheer horror. That looks nicer. A nice light obelisk. With a strange The ancient relic is weirdly enough arid to the touch it reminds you of a teapot. 
This does not remind me of a teapot. That doesn't remind me of a teapot either. <laughs> Got a spear. It's kind of comical. Totally would have picked up that hatchet. Well, this doesn't look like it's from here. Can we go inside this thing? Nope. Just solid. Do we put something on those circular plates? like that area we almost went into. Can we get to it from this side? No, but we can see it. Not sure where that... Oh, that glowing uh, cavern entrance is... I thought it was this direction, but you can't see through all these rocks. Well, this looks like another picnic area. Huh, offering up little tapas. Some eyeball tentacle hors d'oeuvres. Oh, one's missing, and we just happen to have one in our pack. <laughs> There's no way that I would put this in there if I was actually here, because nothing, nothing good can come out of this. How do we do this now? Oh, we don't have it. That's weird. I had the, uh, I had that thing from the lighthouse, and our sphere is gone. Oh, there's an arrow. How do I... There we go. Okay. Thought maybe we lost everything. So we can carry more. Just eight? Did I get the eyeball biscuit? I don't know. Here goes nothing. Oh! Well, we summoned more tentacles. We don't have any health readout. So, I guess we're okay. Hmm. I guess let's head back to that hit and see what the deal is there. It's over there, but we have to go around. Something black and roundish is in the pit. Didn't look as smooth as that black sphere we just came across. But it could be. Or it could be... How did we get there? Or it could be the top of something's head. Because there seem to be a bunch of dead things around it. like some sort of mirror or entrance. Well, I 
can't imagine that I'd like to go down there because I don't see any way to get back up. Oh, there's another one of those things. Yes! Just stumbling around the island, killing something's young. Well, we got more places to explore before we jump down there and get trapped. So. Thanks, but no thanks. Can I go further this way? Nope, nothing doing. Huh. New sounds. We didn't look uh, down here. Let's see what's under here. Another, another medallion and a note. Which one's that? Moved it to the lighthouse to continue his little experiments. Almost certain he's mad. Not another one. Oh, we kind of rotate it. I had to hide. I had to. I ran. I climbed the rocks and tried to hide. That's when I fell into a pit full of dead bodies. Oh, is that the pit we were just in? That's when the rest of the crew caught me. They stripped me naked and they locked me down here. They accused me that I was the one that brought the bad luck onto them by placing these talisman for them and blocking the passages. So, this is the lighthouse resident this parish down here because his uh friends turned on him can we go over here we can taking us closer to whatever that wriggling thing is. Which one was that now? I've offered... I don't see it. Seems like you have to pick it up. Yeah, okay. We do not dare to walk the shores when the night comes. Yeah, yeah. Good, uh, good plan. That boat looks almost intact. And there's a plane. I don't know why we're heading this way. Seems like the wrong way to go. Although, that boat does seem like the right way to go. Let's ski daddle. I don't think it's gonna be that easy though. That's on some rocks. Still good though. Huh. Can we go out here? Oh, we got a camera set up. Pleasant. There's another little statuette. The orca. Isn't that the boat from Jaws? Huh. 
take that. I'm not gonna take that. No symmetrical shape that could define a logical form. Asymmetrical mouths all over its body. Seems like that's what that is. Take a pipe. Could use a good relaxing pipe smoke right about now. Well, we're getting closer. Is that another sphere? Well, here goes nothing. Whoa, okay. Uh, I don't see anything. Oh no. Oh no, that's coming over. Um, I don't think our spear is going to cut it. Yeah, that's not good. That's a dead end. Always oh, letting out underlings. That's a dead end. That's coming straight for us. Um, don't want to get caught on rocks. not too bad. Dropped another one. Um, can we get under him? I don't want to try that just yet. Can we get up there? Two, eh? Backing off? You better. That's right, you better run. Can we get over there? No, it closed back up again. But we got the sphere, our second sphere. Well, with that glorious victory, I think I'll call that a session. There's a little taste of the Shore VR Early Access, currently available on Steam. If you haven't already, take a minute to click the S in the corner to subscribe. Heading for 10,000 subscribers, it'd be fantastic if you were one of them. Also like, share, leave a comment, let me know what you think of the video, or the game, or any tips or tricks you have for the shore or the shore VR. Thanks for watching and we'll catch you next time.